The last decade for DC hasn't exactly been smooth sailing. A lot of bumps in the road, there's no denying that. But the last year for DC Studios has been complete and total chaos and an unmitigated disaster. Not only have you had massive box office failures with every single movie that's been released, Black Adam, Shazam 2, The Flash, Blue Beetle, and of course, to round it all off at the end of the year, Aquaman 2, which seems at this point like it's going to be yet another failure. But you also, just in general, have chaos surrounding the entire studio with James Gunn at the helm. The reason that James Gunn was supposed to come in to reboot this entire universe was because of the chaos that was surrounding them beforehand. But unfortunately for James Gunn, over the past year, all he's done, instead of make people feel good about the future of DC, he's just made more people question his decisions. The first one, of course, being to get rid of Henry Cavill as Superman, saying we're done with that. And if it had been a full recast of everybody, I think people could have got behind that. But unfortunately... People are very much in the dark about what the future of the DCU is even all about. Who's going to be in it? Who's going to be recast? Who's not going to be recast? It certainly hasn't helped them at the box office by leaving these things uncertain. And now yet again, another report, a rumor surrounding Gal Gadot's future as Wonder Woman has surfaced and it just continues to flop back and forth. If you remember... When James Gunn came in, they pretty much announced Patty Jenkins, she's done. She's not going to be making Wonder Woman 3. Patty Jenkins said things went down much differently between her and the studio. That's a different story. But people assumed that Gal Gadot was no longer going to be Wonder Woman. Then Gal Gadot comes out and gives a bunch of interviews talking about, I talked to James, I talked to Peter Safran. We can't wait. We're going to do another Wonder Woman movie. I can't wait to be Wonder Woman again. Then Warner Brothers actually comes out and makes a statement, no, that's not the case. There's no Wonder Woman 3 in the works with Gal Gadot or anyone else for that matter. Well, once again, we have new reports. New Wonder Woman rumor refutes reports. And it's all about Gal Gadot. Gal Gadot's return as Wonder Woman in James Gunn's DCU is still on the cards. Claims a source sparking new hope among fans that say this is the only thing I'm excited about. Uh, Let's take a look at some of this. A few months back, Gal Gadot herself sparked hopes of a return to DC as Wonder Woman with her cryptic comments, but nothing solid came up after that. I don't even know if it was like cryptic comments. She straight up said, I talked to James and Peter. They said, I'm going to do it. Then Warner Brothers comes out and tells Vanity Fair, Deadline, Variety, all these places. No, that's not happening. Like official Warner Brothers sources. Now, all of a sudden, the rumors are saying that uh, Gal Gadot could certainly be back as Wonder Woman. A known scooper shared the news that Gal will be back in the role of Diana Prince. The post read sources confirmed, despite reports saying otherwise, Gal Gadot will be back as Wonder Woman for James Gunn's DCU. And, of course, the first question, well, if she's going to be back, then why aren't all these other people coming back? And, again, the chaos that surrounds DC right now. And it all has to be laid at the feet of James Gunn. We have not seen a single movie from James Gunn. He's made decisions. He's absolutely made creative decisions. The decision to change the ending of the Flash movie. A lot of stuff that's going down in Aquaman will be James Gunn's decision in terms of an editorial standpoint, reshoot, stuff like that. But it's not like we've seen a full James Gunn movie for the new DCU. We saw his The Suicide Squad. Obviously, that was in an old iteration. But one of the reasons you continue to see these box office failures is because people have no idea what's going on at DC. They don't know what the future is. They don't know what these characters mean going forward. They don't know who's going or going to not be a part of the DC universe going forward. So why would you get invested? That's not the reason that these last five movies or four movies will be five with Aquaman have flopped, but it's certainly a contributing factor. You can't deny that it's contributed. That uncertainty that James Gunn has provided has absolutely contributed to the failure of these movies. And now it looks like once again, we're in that cycle where people have no idea what to expect going forward when it comes to Wonder Woman and Gal Gadot. What do you guys think? Let me know about the latest report in the comments section below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.